Hey guys, Anthony here from the Faculty of Apps. And if like me, you prefer using Google Drive over iCloud, then it's really handy to be able to access your Google Drive documents directly from Finder. To achieve this, you simply need to download Drives for Desktop, which you can access from your Google Drive website. Having downloaded the installer, follow the prompts and install the app in the usual way. You'll then be asked to sign into your Google account and having signed in, you want to start by opening Preferences. Here you can opt to take a tour of the app's features, but for now, we'll dive straight in. By default, a Google Drive folder is added to the root of your home directory. This Google Drive folder will sync with the online version of your account. If you wish to sync any additional folders, you can add them here. However, I find that adding additional different folders starts to get a bit messy. I prefer knowing that the files I'm syncing to the cloud are all contained within my single drives folder. Clicking on this second menu option allows you to choose between streaming documents from your drive or creating a copy of them. Streaming basically means that none of your Google Drive documents are ever saved locally to your Mac. When you open a document, you're opening the online version. This is useful for desktop users who know that their Mac will always be connected to the internet, or if you're short on storage space. Mirroring, on the other hand, is good for laptop users who might not always be connected to the internet. Mirroring creates a local copy of your Google Drive documents, which you can access offline. Click OK and choose one of the two options. You'll likely see some pop-up notifications, which you can close, and then you just need to restart Google Drive. That completes the setup process. Now when you next open Finder, you should see your Google Drive folder in the root of your profile and a shortcut to the same folder in the sidebar. As long as I'm connected to the internet, my Drives folder on my Mac will automatically sync with my online account. If I want to upload a file to my Drive, it's simply a matter of dragging the file to my Drives folder in Finder. Give it a few seconds to upload and the file should appear in your online account. Likewise, any documents or files I create online in my Google Drive will automatically download to my Mac. So for instance, if I create a new Google Doc, it will show up in Finder. Because I chose to create a mirror copy of my Google Drive, I can continue to access any of my existing files or create new ones even when I'm not connected to the internet. Once back online, any changes or updates I've made to a document will sync automatically. Finally, if you don't see a shortcut to your Drives folder in your sidebar, just navigate to your home folder and you can always drag it to the sidebar from there. Also, you may notice this Google Drives folder under Locations. This will show you your online version of your account and also any other computers where you have Google Drives installed. So here you can see that I'm also using drives on my MacBook and my work PC. I can view the files I have saved on these computers and download any of the files by clicking this icon. So that is how to set up and use Google Drives on Mac. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hitting subscribe for lots more quick tips on all your Apple devices. Until next time, my name is Anthony. Thank you very much for watching.